Hello friends, in this lecture you are going to learn about Wigner cipher. So what basically you will be given is plain text, key and there are two rules for cipher text and to convert cipher text into plain text. So first you have given that plain text C is listening and key is Pascal. So what is your length? Key length is 6. So you have to divide plain text in 6-6 six, six blocks S H E I S L So this is one block Now I S T E N N I This is another block And lastly N N G So you have divided the plain text into different blocks according to the length of T. Now write the corresponding value of alphabets. So for S it is 18, for H is 7, for E is 4, for I is 8, for again for S is 18 and for L is 11 3, 4, 5, 6 for I again it's 8 for S is 18 for T it's 19 for E is 4 for N is 13 for I is 8 so again, again 8 6 6 color 6 blocks for n it's 13 and for g is 6 so you have written all the plain text into digit now you have to write below the key so key will be substitute downwards Pascal again, so you have to write in a line for S is P for H S C A N L. Write the corresponding value of Pascal into digits. So for P is 15, for A is 0, for S is 18, for C is 2, for A is 0, and for L is 11. So this is 6 blocks. You have to copy same again. You have to just write Pascal here. C A L and P A only because no more plain text is available. So for P is 15 O 18 0 sorry 0 again 11 15 and 0. So S and P as you can see the above formula C i is equal to P i plus K mod 26. So you have to add these two values corresponding 18 plus 15 mod 26. So what will be 18 plus 15 mod 26. will be 7 so just write 7 here for 7 plus 0 mod 26 will be again equal to 7 4 plus 18 mod 26 will be 22 for 8 plus 2 will be 10 again 18 and 22 so these are 6 terms again for this another I S T E I N 8 plus 15 will be equal to 23 mod 26 will be again 23 18 19 plus 18 will be equal to 37 so its mod value will be equal to 11 4 plus 2 6 13 and 19 so this is again a block of 6 
Now for n and g, 13 plus 15 is 28, mod 26 will be equal to 2. And for 6 plus 0 is equal to 6. So you have converted into ciphertext. Now you have to just write this numeric value into alphabetic form. So what will be 7 H H for 22 it is W for 10 is K 18 is S for 22 again W 23 is X 18 S 11 is L 6 is G 13 is N, 19 is T, and 2 is C, and 6 is G. So, your ciphertext will be equal to H, H, W, K, S, W, X, S, L, G, N, T, and C, G. So, this is your ciphertext. Now, if you want to get from ciphertext to plain text you have to subtract the key value same you have to follow the same procedure you have to divide this in six blocks and you have to add key value pascal and do this same again so i will do just for three letters h h w and you do it by yourself for another letters so for h h w Okay, I will do it for whole column H at W K S. So these are six for H is seven seven twenty two ten eight. So you can take this as so it will be seven seven twenty two ten eighteen and twenty two. So this is six blocks. So I as I told you that you have to write key below the block. So you have to write block a key here. A key is Pascal. So value of Pascal is 15, 0, 18, 2, 0 and 11. Now to get plain text, just see the corresponding value 7 and 15. So the formula is subtract ciphertext minus key. So your ciphertext value is 7. Subtract 15. So its value will be equal to minus 8. 7 minus 15 will be equal to minus 8. Now you have to here do the additive cipher with the domain. Here domain is 26. So just add 26 here. It will be equal to 18. Okay. So for 7 and 0, 7 minus 0, it will be equal to 7. For 22 minus 18 will be mod 26 will be equal to 4. 10 minus 2 mod 26 will be equal to 8. 18 minus 0 mod 26 will be equal to 18. And for the last one 22 minus 11 mod 26 will be equal to 11. So now you can just see that 18, 7, 4, 8, 18, 11. Just write the corresponding alphabetic value of these numbers. So it will be for 18, it's S, for 7 is H, E, I, S, L. As you can see, this plain text above here S, H, E, I, S, L. So this is the encryption algorithm and decryption algorithm of a Virginia cipher. Thank you.